65-year-old Milton Potts has done well with his life. He had a long career as a mechanical engineer, but when he retired and tried to work part-time out of his home, the jobs weren't there and he was having a tough time living off of Social Security alone. Good morning, Lori. Hi, Milton. How are you doing? Who you got me for today? I got you for Miss Moore. Oh, Miss Moore. With the help of the Senior Community Service, service Employment great. Program and the Tennessee Department of Labor and Workforce Development, Mr. Potts has a new lease on life. Uh, with a show of hands, raise your hand if you've learned something that you didn't know today. I saw uh, this I think there... The program offers seniors 55 and up skills training and places them into a nonprofit organization or governmental agency to receive paid on-the-job training subsidized by the federal government. Eventually, the program can lead to a full-time position. And the Indians use piranha's teeth for scissors. I learned that. I didn't know that. Now Milton is a substitute teacher. And I started out by helping teachers just run copies over at the Sycamore High School. And I did that for a whole year. Then someone there suggested that I would make a good substitute teacher. And I thought, mm -hmm. I was never around children, and so I wasn't that sure. All my siblings were older than, my next sibling was five years older. And I wasn't sure, but the first day I came out of the classroom, I knew I'd found something I could have loved as much as I did engineering. I was an engineer all my life and loved my job. Principal Diane Williams says her school system has been involved with the Senior Community Service Employment Program for two years. Yeah, oh, I think it's wonderful. It's, it's great uh, just to see them feel like they're important again and feel like they have a place in life that they're actually meaningful and making a difference in people. And to come in here in education, I mean, there's nothing more worthwhile than, and satisfying to to meet the needs of a student and see that you've done something to help their life be successful. I'm Milton Potts and I'm subbing for Miss Moore today. The program places seniors in all types of jobs. It turns it. out teaching was a good fit for Milton. He urges other seniors to get involved too. System. No, it, I recommend it highly for people that want to get out of the home and get back into being part of the workforce. And. Uh, I think it's a wonderful thing. Milton's job is part-time. He gets $55 a day for substitute teaching, and he works three to four days a week. And that's the way he wants it. You see, Milton has turned into a student himself. He's pursuing his engineering degree he never had the chance to get earlier in life. He says his experience with the Senior Community Service Program and teaching children has given him the boost of confidence he needed. Uh, it's been real positive for me. I can walk through the cafeteria and it's hard to explain the feeling you get when they all say, hey, Mr. Potts. And it's just a good feeling to know that you're liked. And even though they know I'm strict, I am strict, but I'm fair. And uh, it, it, it's, been, it's been good. I, I think if you took a, a poll I would be 95% liked at least, I'm sure. I'm in the A, I'm in the A range, I know.